By the way, when he says I would, Trump says I would end the war in Ukraine tomorrow, that means he would cave to Vladimir yeah. Putin and give him whatever he wants. Exactly. That's, not, that's how he would end it. But to Claire's point, we're talking about cosmetics, and a lot of that's important. Is this guy too old? And look at the way he speaks. That's important. But listen to the substance of what they're saying. Listen to what Donald Trump was saying last night. It was lie after lie after lie about the economy. Everything he said about our economy was wrong whether it was employment data or oil production. That scares He's me. He's making up a story about this country so he can come in and ride to the rescue, a story mm -hmm. that's not true. He's talking about these secret flights of 300,000 migrants that have been dropped into the United States to raucous applause in the room. He's writing and telling a story that is not true. Listen to the substance. The cosmetics, the superficial part about Joe Biden, how he walks, all that stuff, that's interesting. And if you think that's important, that's up to you, but yeah. listen to what they're saying. Thank you. FDR ended the Depression, won a war against Nazism and Japanese imperialism. He didn't walk so well. So, I mean, again, you can focus on what you want to focus on, but, I mean, it's, it's really crazy. I will say, Mika, as Willie was saying, it, it, Trump lies. It's lie after lie after lie after lie that we really need more, more people on other networks and this yes. network, on every network, when Donald Trump starts doing that, to do what Neil Cavuto does. Mm -hmm. And he'll just pull out of, of, of a speech, say, listen, I have to tell you, he said the election was stolen. There's absolutely no evidence of that, 63 courts. And then he goes down the line. He said the economy's worse than it's ever been. None of the numbers show that. The economy's actually stronger than anywhere else in the world. That's what Neil does at 4 p.m. on Fox News. Uh, Steve Ducey does it uh, yeah. a good bit as well. Yeah. Uh, it, it, democracy depends on people at every network doing that. I know. The problem is there are more anchors and hosts who do the opposite and promulgate the lies. But you are right. It would help if a news host would deliver the news as fact. With uh, Nikki Haley exiting the race later this morning, the general election essentially starts today.